Rianne Lee Greenwich. I'm from Aetheron, County Galway. I actually remember when I made the decision to study biomedical engineering. So we had a lecturer come out to visit our school in Spittle and talk about the engineering programmes. And he spoke about bioengineering. And from that, I, I knew immediately that that's what I wanted to study. It was that mix of you know, mechanical engineering, but applied to biology and creating new things to help patients and to even save lives. I studied bioengineering, really enjoyed that program. It was not only the theory of engineering, but also really applied to medical devices, medical device testing, and, you know, clinical solutions for problems that needed to be solved. Went on from the undergraduate degree to study a PhD with Professor Mark Bruzzi, looking at new ways to design and test devices. The name Proverium comes from looking at trying to promote and preserve the vera montana, which is a feature within the prostate that many technologies may not be able to do due to their mode of action. And what we wanted to do with the Pro-V device was ensure that we treated the BPH and treated the, the disease, but left all other clinical anatomical functions alone. There is currently no device on the market that is as low a profile as ours, that has potential to have as least side effects as ours. And what we're seeing in our clinical data is that we've got an excellent safety profile and uh, good efficacy as well. I have a huge passion for the medical device industry. With medical devices, you have the potential to help lots of people with something. And there are many things that patients are suffering from. You've hospitals that are overloaded and there are lots of problems that can be fixed with new devices. The fact that we as the medical device community can come and alleviate some of those issues and challenges by taking a look at unmet clinical needs and seeing, well, what can we do to fix this is something that's you know, hugely powerful to us as a, as a community and something I feel very strongly about. Really in Galway, what you have is an ecosystem where you have medical device entrepreneurs, researchers and people with various backgrounds working together to create new technologies to help the medical device community at large. When I got the, the news that I had been given the award, I was very shocked in the best way. For me to be considered within that group of people, I was really humbled by it. I feel that this is not just a personal achievement, I think it really does speak to the team in Proverum that have worked so hard and uh, achieved great things with our technology and bringing our technology forward and I feel like I'm, I'm very proud of what we've achieved together. I really look back fondly at my time in the University of Galway. I loved it from when I started it. I remember the class size in engineering was very small. That sense of community really started for me within the undergraduate degree that I did in Galway and has continued as I moved through the medical device community. It's a very supportive and collaborative field and that's probably one of the best memories I have of the university is that sense of working together. It's hugely exciting for Proverm to be where we are now and as a co-founder to have been there from the start, to have been there when we were designing how it was going to work, what the components were going to do, how they were going to move together, how we were going to get the device in, what the device was going to feel like, all of that is, is hugely exciting to see where it is now and to see it now in its commercial version and to be out the other side of a large clinical study where we've tested the efficacy of the device is really exciting.